In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to compress HD video. Now, HD video is a lot larger than standard video, and you might want to compress it if you want to save space on your computer, because these files can be very large, and of course, if you want to upload it to the internet, which can take a lot of time if it's a large file, and also slow down your bandwidth. So, I'm going to be compressing an HD video using a program called Virtual Dub. Virtual Dub is an excellent program. It's very fast to download. It opens up very quickly on your computer and I highly recommend it. If you don't have it, type Virtual Dub in the search and download it. It's absolutely free. That's the best thing about it. Excellent program. Let's open it up. See, it opens up very quickly. And let's locate an HD video that I want to compress. I have one over here that's 344 megabytes. This video is a little bit longer than three minutes long. It shows you how large these files can be. So let's just drag and drop it. And the next thing we have to do is go to Video, Compression, and select the XFID MPEG-4 codec. Now if you don't have the XFID codec, just type XFID in the search and get the latest XVID codec which is compatible with your operating system. Now I think there are other codecs that you can use but this is the one that works for me. So select that, go to OK, so select that. Now the next thing you have to do is to go to configure. Now here's the whole key to the compression. As you can see to the left it's maximum quality and to the right you have the smallest file. Now as you move this towards the right the newly compressed file that you convert to is going to be smaller. That's what we want to do. Now if you make it too small what might happen is it might compromise the quality. So this is trial and error. You have to open up the newly compressed file, play it in comparison to the original one. And if to your liking it's good, you can keep it. If you want to make it a bit larger because you don't like the resulting file, you don't think that it has the same quality as the original one, you can move this towards the left and just recompress. So it's really to your liking. And you're always going to have the original file. So, you know, you can always recompress until you get it right. So it's trial and error based on your liking. So let's go to OK. And the next thing we have to do is go to File, Save as AVI. So let's name it 2 after the original one. This is the original file. And go to Save. Now this is going to take some time. It depends on the speed of your computer, how fast it's going to compress. Okay, so there you go. The file is now converted. Now let's check the size of the new file. It's only 89.5 megabytes and the original was, again, 344 megabytes. So it's significantly smaller. Let's open it up and play it and see how it works. So there's the new file. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the Wi Fi. And there's the original one. They both look great to me. So there you go how to compress an HD video using Virtual Dub. I hope you found this video useful to you. If you have, please show your support for this channel by subscribing. Please like up the video. Feel free to leave comments. And thank you for tuning in.